of course, is Sebastian De La Cruz. He's got a great voice. Oh, I just, oh, that just gets you. So he is helping us kick off our show today and, of course, day two of the San Antonio Film Festival. Yes, we have a lot in store for you today, including a great deal on delicious food, um, cocktails with a San Antonio twist, even an outdoor adventure you need to hit up before summer is over. But first, we are joined by two of South Texas' biggest stars, Pepe Serna and Sebastian De La Cruz. Gentlemen, yeah. thank you so very much for joining right. us. And you're both starring, as we heard right in the uh, little tease at the end of the newscast in a movie that debuts tonight at the Tobin. Sure. It is called Margarita Man. The Margarita yes. Man. Margarita Man. And, yes, and we love margaritas, of course, in San Antonio. Mm. So we kind of set up some margarita stations. That's the real one. And then, of course, for Sebastian, we have a mocktail margarita Our, Actually, session. I was thinking oh, something what? a little different. Do you have another drink of choice? I brought my own. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh. Have yeah. no cool travel. <laughs> My preferred poison. It does a body cut. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, you got to do the mustache. Like, oh, yeah. Milk. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. There we go. He's got it down. So, okay, as we start making some of these cocktails, uh, tell us about the movie. Oh, man, the movie is just great. It's, uh, Danny Ramos, uh, a local that has been in California for years, it was uh, his story, his family story. Mm -hmm. So he made me some cool margaritas, right? Yes, sir, yes, sir. <laughs> and uh, it's just a very fun overall story in general. Um, there's a lot of obstacles that we have to overcome in the movie, and mm -hmm. it'll make you laugh, it'll make you cry. It's just a movie for the family, I think. It's a very great, very it, it, great movie. It is. It's a youth-oriented uh, film uh, with uh, the... It's, it's just fabulous to work um, with local and being a Texan. I was like one of the original Texans to, to go to Hollywood. And, and uh, my first movie was in 64. So I've been at it for a couple of nights. And, <laughs> and, uh, th but the thing is, is that we're everywhere. There's kids out there and, and teenagers, grown-ups that, that still have a dream and c continue to follow your dream. Uh-oh, here come the margaritas. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so so no, what's... So, go ahead. So, Sebastian, of course, mm -hmm. you're, you're standing next to a legendary yes. actor. Uh, Danny Trejo's also in this movie. What was it like working next to them? Working with people like Pepe Serna, Danny Trejo, uh, Jesse Borrego, it's amazing. It's a blessing. Um, it's like they're the pioneers in a way. And especially this uh, movie, um, there, since me being a Latino in this movie, I think it's important that uh, I wasn't, you know, seen as a low rider or anything. I was actually seen as a boy genius, as a nerd. And um, I think that's very important in seeing that, you know, Latinos aren't just low riders, you know, getting tattoos and stuff like that. But learning from them, it's been an, an amazing experience. And like I said, it's been a, bla a blessing. So you said learning from them. Yes. What was the advice that he gave you? Oh, he gave me a lot of advice about chicks, uh, about shooting guns. <laughs> no, uh, that's all jokes. Chick lit. Chick lit. Chick lit. <laughs> Don't you? I think, uh, Your phone's ringing. It's his mother I, calling I, I, right now. So. I think that the best advice was uh, I was reading the script and for getting ready for one of the most important scenes. And I was really concentrating, and he came up to me and he said, hey, he was like, don't worry. He said, make this your own. Uh, don't just read it off the bat. Like, make sure that you're not reading it as the character, but you are the character. Make it your own. And I live with that every day, and I made it my own. So come check it out at the San Antonio Film Festival. That's fantastic. So what's it like when you're shooting? Because obviously you've done a lot in Hollywood and location everywhere. But, you know, when a movie is based here and it's everything from the first time they say action to the last time they say cut is done right here in town. It's fabulous. One of my, a couple of my first movies, one was uh, 300 miles, not my first movies, but that I did here in San Antonio, 300 miles for Stephanie, mm -hmm. about three uh, uh, Chicano cops in 1980, and then uh, Honeysuckle Rose with Willie Nelson, okay. and Seguin, the first uh, Texas Mexican mayor, and fought at the Alamo with the Texans. So we have so much history, and, and for me to celebrate for, for our community, uh, black, brown, white, it doesn't matter, man. We're all Texans, Americans, and that's what we're trying to convey is that we're here to do it. Oh. We'll drink We'll drink to that. All right. We'll drink well, here's, to that. Here's so the Margarita look. Man, and the Margarita Man is uh, previewing tonight at the Tobin Center. It starts at 9 o'clock. Tickets are $15. And for more information on the San Antonio Film Festival, go to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. And we're going to get these guys to uh, maybe hang out a little bit for our next segment coming up here.